guess what? My baby took me someplace incredible with a lot of cool cars. And we're going to show you one right after this message. Hurry up and wait now. We love doing a wide variety of vehicles, car shows, and cruise-ins, so make sure you smash that subscribe button and hit that bell. That way you don't miss anything. Wow, what an amazing find. No matter what your opinion is behind the story of this popular vehicle, one thing is indisputable. This is the most controversial vehicle produced by a large modern automobile manufacturer. Due to what happened, it has now become one of the most rare vehicles as well. In 1990, GM unveiled a concept car that would later lead to the production of the EV1 in 1996. With regular lead acid batteries, its range averaged 55 miles. By 1999, improvements like nickel metal hydride batteries helped improve the range to 95 miles and charging times were only three to seven hours. This puts its charging and range performance on par with some of the best EVs being manufactured as much as 10 to 20 years later, including the much loved Nissan Leaf. Even the 2015 Nissan Leaf could not exceed this 95 mile range until 2016. The much higher priced Tesla didn't even exist until 2008, almost a decade after the EV1. Leaving this the much loved advanced electric car way ahead of its time and the impressive king of the EVs. Unfortunately, the EV1 program was discontinued in 2002. Every EV1 on the road was repossessed. Lessees were not given the option to purchase their cars from GM. The majority of the repossessed EV1s were crushed. Only about 40 were delivered to museums and educational institutes with their electric powertrains deactivated. Under the agreement that the cars were not to be reactivated and driven on the road. About 20 units were donated to overseas institutions. In 2016, the TV show Jay Leno's Garage presented a video of an intact EV1, which is part of the collection of the famous filmmaker Francis Ford Coppola. The only fully intact EV1 was donated to the Smithsonian Institution. 
However, it is much more affordable and convenient to visit this exciting rare survivor we filmed right here in Georgia at the TELUS Museum. Make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss anything. And watch our other videos to find out what this vehicle is. And find out what the next vehicle is. The museum staff has very good reason to be so protective of such very rare and valuable vehicles. Please do not attempt to bring tripods and other unauthorized filming equipment into the museum. We appreciate the museum staff giving us special permission to bring our camera equipment so near to such valuable and rare vehicles. What powers this vehicle? Who built this vehicle? What is this? What kind of motorcycle is that? Watching our videos. Gracias para ver nuestro videos. If you watch many of our videos, you'll notice we do a wide variety of vehicles. Si esto lo vio algunos de nosotros videos, tú sabes que nosotros haga un Montón de diferentes tipos de carros. If you want us to film your vehicle, please let us know in the comments below. Si esto le gusta nosotros filmar tu auto, por favor, deja tu comentario ahí abajo después de toca de campaña y inscribirse. Gracias. Ciao. Bye bye. Here's Victor. With, to tell you about the wonderful vehicle in this video. Aquí está Victor para decirte todo sobre este maravilloso uh, auto en el video. video. <laughs> <laughs>